This is Julia, Reference Librarian at McAllen Public Library. Welcome to Creative Tech, where we'll be looking at ways that technology and design can make your life a little bit easier and a little bit more fun. So today we're going to go over Emoji and Memoji and Bitmoji, uh, what they are and uh, what the difference is between them and how to get them. I got the idea for doing this video when I was helping a family member recently uh, with Emoji. So even if you already know what they are, uh, you could always show this uh, video to a family member who uh, might not be as familiar with them as you are. So here we have an example text message open. Um, the way you get to the emoji keyboard on an iPhone is uh, you go to the little uh, happy face down here in the corner. That's the emoji button. Uh, on an Android, it'll probably be something similar. So now we're on the emoji menu. Uh, there are hundreds of emoji. If you scroll or swipe to the left, uh, to the left or the right, you'll go through all of them. They're organized into different uh, sections. You can also jump to different sections with the little icons down here at the bottom. Uh, like here at the beginning, it'll show you frequently frequently used, and then it'll go to uh, different kinds of smiley faces and people doing different things, different hand gestures, and the next category is animals and nature. And the next category after that is food and drink. Uh, next category is activity. Uh, so different kinds of uh, sports, uh, hobbies, uh, travel and places. So different kinds of vehicles, places, city skylines, that kind of thing. And then there are different kinds of objects like uh, computers, um, devices, uh, tools, anything like that. And then finally, at the end, you have symbols, uh, so different uh, kinds of hearts and uh, different, uh, just all different kinds of symbols. And then at the very end, you have different uh, flags from around the world. Uh, so this is how you scroll through all of them. But let's say you know you're looking for something in particular, like you know you're looking for a laughing face. Uh, you can go to the search emoji bubble here at the top and type whatever kind of emotion you're looking for. So we'll do laugh and it'll show you all of the emojis that are laughing. Or for example, you could do angry and it'll show you all of the angry emojis. So on an iPhone, besides the regular emoji, iPhones also have another cool feature called the Memoji. Uh, they're the regular Memoji and they're, then they're like the video emoji. Uh, so we'll go over the regular Memoji first. Uh, to get to those, you go to the little icon here that's uh, like different faces with the, the heart eyes. Uh, so you'll go to that one. And then it'll bring up different choices. Uh, the first one at the top is one that looks like you and it's doing different uh, emoji things. Like it has the standard emoji facial, facial expressions like the sad face, the heart face, the exploding head, uh, all the different like uh, standard emoji, um, emoji expressions, but it's a face that looks like you. Or if you go back up to the top, you can go through all of these uh, characters here. So like there's a robot, a cat, a dog, a shark, uh, all sorts of different uh, fun characters. And if you go to the plus sign right here on the left, uh, it's going to bring up a, a menu where you can make one that uh, looks like you or looks like, uh, like any character you want. Uh, so you could make a totally personalized one or you could make a, like a complete, completely imaginary character. So it's a fun thing to play around with. So now the last option is the video memoji and I think that one's the most fun. Uh, it's right next to the other one that we just did. It's the little face with a yellow square around it. So you go there. And similar to the other one, it'll start out with the face that looks like you or you can scroll through it and go through all these different uh, characters. And the difference with this one is that it's uh, it's actually a video. The little red circle in the corner in the corner down here is a record button and it'll record whatever you're saying. So it's like you can record a message and send it to the person who you're texting. Uh, I particularly like this unicorn right here. This one's fun. Um, but you go back to the beginning and this is the one that looks like you. And the little red button down here in the bottom right corner, 
that is to record your message. And when you're done, you can send a short and cute uh, video message to your friend. Uh, and the plus sign over here, it's just like the other one. That's where you can create a completely new character. Now, the last feature we're going to cover here is uh, the Bitmoji app. Uh, so this is an app that you can get on any device, Apple or iPhone. It's not just an iPhone feature. Uh, the app is called Bitmoji. And the way it works is that you make an avatar of yourself or whatever other kind of character you want. And then it has hundreds of stickers for all kinds of things that you can go through. And then you can save these stickers and send them to send them to a friend. Um, so the avatar here is how you make the avatar that looks like either yourself or whatever kind of character you want. So you can change the hair, the eyes, the clothes, anything you want. You can completely personalize it. Uh, so then once you have your avatar ready, uh, all of these stickers will update and it'll have your avatar doing all of these things. So let's say you have you have an avatar that you like. Uh, you want to send that to a friend. You just tap on it and then you save the image the same way as if you were saving any other photo. And then it'll save it with the photos on your device and you can send it uh, just like a, you would a regular photo in a text message. So this is a fun way to send uh, cute little personalized uh, greetings and messages to friends. This was Julia and thank you for watching. Be sure to follow MPL Adults on Facebook and McCallum Public Library on YouTube and don't miss any of our virtual programs.